Dave Kirtman, the CEO of a company that offers mental health services, has been through a lot as a Mets fan There was the series-ending walk in the 1999 NLCS, falling to the Yankees in the 2000 World Series and the late-season collapses of 2007 and 2008 Worst of all, he says, was Carlos Beltran's strikeout in Game 7 of the 2006 NLCS Yes, the average Mets fan is accustomed to trauma So in the middle of another down season, Kirkman decided to do something about it His company, Yuma Health, is offering something he believes might be more valuable to individual Mets fans than any trader signing a free therapy session Self-identifying Mets fans can get a promotional code for a trip to a therapist's sofa All they have to do is fill out an online form detailing their most difficult Mets moment and they will be able to see any therapist in Yuma Health's network under $200 It can be very frustrating to watch as your team goes out and makes mistake after mistake, Kirkman said We often talk about our teams like we can control them So I thought to myself, I can't make the Mets any better but maybe I can make Mets fans' lives a little better by offering free therapy See also Mets pounded 25-4 for worst loss in franchise history Washington, this is the vaunted pitching on which the Yuma Health allows users to find and pay for therapists on its website, which Kirkman hopes will help alleviate some of the Mets-induced misery Kirkland said the frustration has been a part of his life since he was 10 I've been a lifelong Mets fan and 1986 was my first year watching the team, he said It's been downhill ever since Kirkman said he came up with the idea earlier this year but he wanted to wait for something Mets to happen before doing the promotion Then, on Tuesday night the Mets suffered a historically embarrassing 25-4 loss to the Nationals in which infielder Jose Reyes pitched and allowed six runs in the eighth inning It was the worst defeat in franchise history He says a couple dozen fans have already signed up for the deal, which went online Wednesday The primary goal of the light-hearted promotion is more to raise awareness of therapy than any sort of real benefit for the mental health of Mets fans, Kirkman said If this becomes an excuse for someone to seek out help for their marriage or career, that would be great, he said If they want to talk about the Mets, they can do that too my long-term vision is to make therapy less stigmatized In this society, we idolize physical fitness If you say you're going to the gym, you get a high five If you say you're going to therapy, you get asked what's wrong See also years of Mets frustration is moving into cursed territory It begins as just a year, actually a good year The Mets are in the middle of a bad season and find themselves at 44-61, a whopping 14 games behind the Phillies in the NL East This all comes after what was the Mets' best start in franchise history, in which they began the season 12-2 Star pitcher Noah Sandergaard even came down with hand, foot and mouth disease, of all things Last year wasn't kind to Mets fans either After a National League pennant and a wild card game, the Mets sunk to fourth in the division Mr. Met even lost it at one point when he was caught on camera sticking up his middle finger to a fan 
but Kirkin said that therapists won't necessarily be blindsided by requests to talk about Jonas Sesvet's heels, they will be warned ahead of time that a Mets fan is coming. I don't think you need to be a Mets fan to be sympathetic to what they face, he said.